today we are gonna do everything differently okay you know sit down explain dress up whatever no not today i got no time for this i need to hurry up because i am planning to wash my hair blow dry my hair and trim my hair Is it supposed to to be heating up like that and be smoking like that? And ah, shit! God damn it! All right, I'm gonna stop because if I burn myself one more time, I swear to God. Look at how. <gasps> Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Hmm? I already pre-put my hair via live session on Instagram. I did got myself a few items. I hope you guys don't mind this type of kind of like taking you guys with me as a vlog kind of thing. So, you know, throughout my wash day and how I'm going to achieve what I am planning to do. Let's hope that work. Shampoo I will be using today is from Flux Hair. You guys already know this shampoo. If you already follow me for a while, I love Flux Hair products. And later on, I'm gonna use my heat cap to trap in the heat. And then follow up with these all items. We're gonna need the scissors later on, okay, to trim. I have here a separation comb, a white tooth comb. Not sure if gonna need this. And then this detangling brush maybe later on. When I have successfully blow dried and straightened my hair so i can use these to brush through i will be using a blow dryer not sure if i'm, if I'm gonna use that tip or this one and then i have a straightener but i have been having this for years and i've actually never used it i'm thinking that i'm gonna end up using this one so i got this after i watched multiple youtube videos on which straightener thing as you get for afro hair so i'm gonna be testing this today and you guys gonna see how it goes this is how i usually wash my hair over the sink i only apply the shampoo on my scalp and then just like you know focus on the scalp and then while rinsing it out the shampoo go through my hair shaft and can i cleanse those part and when i'm done with that i unravel each small twist and apply my deep conditioner and work that in well i'm done washing my hair i'm gonna make myself some food now and while eating i'm gonna let this heat cap do its work at least for 30 to 45 minutes let's hope and then blow dry and hopefully straighten my hair this is how my hair looked like after i rinse out the deep conditioner my scalp is clean, my hair is bouncy, it's well moisturized. I'm gonna go ahead and separate my hair into six big sections because I don't want them to be on my way. I will be using this leave-in spray from St. Clair's. I have this blow dryer. It has three different types of heat levels, so I'm gonna go for the lower heat because I don't wanna damage my hair. I went ahead and take a little section out of one of the big sections and started working myself through my hair to be honest with you guys this process was very 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 time consuming and i was struggling so hard because this was the second time in my entire hair journey in four and a half years that i am blow drying my hair um as you can see i'm first applying this leave-in spray i i don't know why i was doing that because i thought at some point i thought i need a little bit more moisture if i am gonna go and blow dry my hair so this kind of helped me i don't know if, if i didn't use it if my hair would have turned out differently i guess next time i'm gonna find, find out about that however as i already said this process was very <clears throat> let me say different i didn't know what i was doing uh you can tell by my facial expression that i wasn't feeling it that much it was time consuming my blow dryer wasn't going the right way it's supposed to be going. The tip was always kind of turning around. This hair blowing process actually took me one and a half hour and I was so exhausted. I couldn't wait for it to be done, to be honest. When 
when I was finally done, I was so happy to unravel my hair, to get to see the volume, the length of my hair. I don't know if you can tell, I was pretty excited, even though I was very exhausted from the entire wash day because, sister, by now, almost six hours, I've already passed by and um, whee, I was hungry, I was thirsty, but I was so happy to see my hair, the way it looked like. And um, now, it's time to straighten the hair. However, after watching multiple YouTube videos, I saw how many natural hair girls use these products to apply on their hair as a heat protector. So I'm going for that. My straightener, it has, it has like five levels. So I thought I'm gonna go for level three, but then I quickly find out that it wasn't hot enough. So I went back up to level four and then went back to level three and then to level two because I was so scared. I was so scared I'm gonna burn my hair to death. straight here but is it supposed to to be heating up like that and be smoking like that whoa okay wait let's go for level two then i don't want to rust my hair i mean i don't even know how to get my hair into that thing yet. but once it's in it do kind of straighten for sure but uh, okay i think i got it now whoa 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 Whoa, look at how, oh my God, wow. My hair is so straight, oh my God. And I knew I need to cut to, to trim my hair because down here is just rough. Okay, you can hear it at the end how it's kind of like, you know. Whoa, oh my God. My hair is so straight and it is my first time doing it. I mean, I don't know how to get really close on the root, but let me see how I can do it without burning myself. Okay. Okay, we're better. Okay, you guys still like it. I want to brush this out because I feel like this is it's just a tangle. Let me go one more time. Okay, right now I'm only using two level two, okay? My hair is straight. <gasps> okay, <clears throat> I need to calm down. Whoa, I mean Look how straight and shiny it is. Bro, why do I look so good? Like, look at me, man. Look at me, man. It should be illegal to look this good. <gasps> By doing it myself the first time. This is crazy. Oh, I, I can't wait to see how everything's going to look. Wow. After being halfway done, this is how my hair looked like. I think it looked gorgeous. I wish I, I wouldn't have been that scared to use level 3 or 4 because I'm sure my hair would have even been more sleek and more... Mm, you know what I mean. However, but look at this comparison. Comparing the blow dry side to the flat iron side. Incredible. However, time to do the other side. I have to say that getting used to this straightener was at the beginning a little bit difficult, but once you get the hand out of it, it was pretty easy. I found out during this process that the smaller my section, 
the better it was so i take really small section add the heat protector smoothen that in detangle with the finger and then detangle with the brush before i went in with this flat iron thingy i don't even know how you call them um but it was pretty well it was pretty good you can see by the video that i was able to go pretty close on my scalp without burning myself i didn't actually burn myself any time the only thing i don't like about this straightener is that at least the one that i got there was not like a hand glove with it which i was able to wear to protect maybe my fingers in case it was so hard to burn myself but this is how my hair looked like after i was done i had to go in in between to do some breaks drink and eat food but i don't know if you can tell i was pretty happy i was so happy with the result look at how beautiful how thick how gorgeous how healthy my hair is i'm so in love with it it's so beautiful however for me to continue i decided to split my hair into four tie them away Simply to that section again, split it into two, and then start a little by little by cutting off first like a few centimeters and then brush through again. I repeat multiple times until I was satisfied with the length that I wanted. I didn't want to just cut everything at the same time, I wanted to go step by step. And then when I was done with that section, I combined the two sections together again, brush through to see if they are even, and then I simply trim again i even twirl it around to see if anyone is like standing out i simply repeat that same step on all entire section of my hair then at the end when i was done i combined everything together brushed them down to see if they are even this time while like blow drying and straightening my hair i wanted to at least use the opportunity to trim them all in one length in total i think i got rid about four or five centimeters um not more but i also have to say my hair is quite it's pretty healthy i never use heat this time was the first time that i use a straightener to straighten my hair and also this time was the second time that i've ever blow dry my hair That was it for this video people i hope you enjoyed it thank you very much for stopping by and watching i will see you guys in my next one have a nice sunday